So with all that snow in Winterfell, Bran still has no chill. We had to restart the video about 13 times <laughs> because he really wanted to fucking make that joke. <laughs> <laughs> Hi, I'm David, this is Joe, and today we're going to discuss Game, Game of, Thrones, of Thrones, episode 1, season 8. Whoa, so, it's back, motherfuckers, it's whoa. back. <laughs> After uh, almost two years, Game of Thrones is back. And, uh, and that's all we want to say, so... That's it. All right, get to See you later. Right, yeah. New intro, okay. though, by the way. New intro. New intro, which yeah. honestly... Is my favorite part. Of yeah, I love it. It's you actually get to see inside the buildings now and mm -hmm. everything. That just shows you what it's all boiled down to. It also we, we only have a few more people left, <laughs> yeah. and that's it. It also dips down into like Cersei's mm -hmm. under chef yeah. down there, and then shows a bunch mm -hmm. of shit that she's gonna kill yeah, a dragon with. Basically, <laughs> so it shows all the tombs under Winterfell. Were you disappointed with the lack of action in the first episode? Yes. No. <laughs> Uh, I didn't know we were both uh, answering this question. No, I'm just kidding. I'm, I'm kidding. <laughs> you answer first. Go, yeah. go. No, I, I was, I was, I was disappointed in this episode. Um, not fully, just mm -hmm. disappointed in the amount of action that mm -hmm. we got. I, I understood what they were doing. They gave us pretty much the first episode of season one, but revamped, like remastered. Mm -hmm. Yeah, there's <laughs> a lot of parallels there. Yeah, for sure. It's like. The video game came out 10 years ago, mm -hmm. and then now they do the remake, and this is like, <laughs> the, this, is like the this is like the new version, mm -hmm. but you're like, they changed a lot, but the yeah. developers are like, no, we didn't. <laughs> yeah. It's not like that. Yeah. I think from a story perspective, I understand they need to set everything up, and if you're going to have any sort of arc with rising action, this episode has to be, okay, we get all the reunions out of the way. This was the reunion episode. This is catching you yeah. up. <laughs> yeah, just, hey, here, everybody's here. Look, they're there, there, and there. That's where everybody, let's put all the pieces where they go on the board. Yeah. The next episode, I bet, is going to be rising action. Then the episode after that, the Battle of Winterfell. And then who know, after that, who knows what the fuck's going to happen. Yeah. But it's been a long time yeah. since we've seen all these characters. So yeah, we um, definitely yeah. needed to catch up, and because yeah. I, I honestly forgot where like half these people were. Yeah, I was surprised how many. I had times. no idea where Bronn was. Yeah, I mean, um, not Bronn, but yeah, also Bronn, <laughs> but in the Hound, and like he popped and up. Tormund? Tormund, I thought he was yeah. dead. <laughs> I, I knew, I had a feeling he wasn't, but yeah, yeah he was there. But yeah, so I understood that, even though, yeah. So with the lack of action, I thought that was fine because I know it's coming. Yeah, I just felt that. There's only six episodes of this season, and there's only five episodes left of this season. And I felt like there was six, and then one, they just chucked it <laughs> right out the window. And, you know, I understood why they were doing what they were doing, but I couldn't help but feel like, oh my god, now we're fucking almost done. Now this is it. No. You guys have, you know, I don't, don't want to say wasted, but... They wasted the first episode. <laughs> I totally disagree. I don't and think they, they wasted it at all because you have to look at it. This last season is like one really long movie. And you can't just have the final climactic moment be the entire movie. That would be, it would, you'd get bored. Yeah. You'd just be watching well, no, action after yeah. action and you'd be like, it wouldn't have as much impact. So this is building. This is just laying the groundwork for building up and rising into something. I feel like but. the entirety of Game of Thrones is a movie. And if it was a movie in that sense, then it has mm -hmm. a slow beginning and like, you know, there's the climax and then mm -hmm. now it's the resolution, but they had the setup, the climax, and then a, a setup and mm -hmm. then the resolution. And I feel like you didn't need another setup in there. I feel this is Endgame. <laughs> this is Game of Thrones Endgame. Endgame's not going to do that. They're going to get right into the shit. Well, maybe not. I haven't said that. <laughs> Watch it all. Oh, well, reunions. Yeah, gonna, but... You know what? They, Endgame is going to start with reunions. <laughs> yeah. You fucking they, can they, count on yes. it. Who would win in a staring contest? Bran or Drogon? I'm going to say Bran. Bran would win. He was just the entire episode everywhere. Anytime anybody turned around anywhere, Bran was just... <laughs> yeah. You go to the bathroom, you turn around, Bran. Yeah. <laughs> you wake up <laughs> across the hall, <laughs> Bran. <laughs> Bran's winning that contest. I'm how, did, saying. how the fuck did he get around? <laughs> He's in a wheelchair by himself. <laughs> how did he get to like all of his heights and like? Well, his arms move, right? Yeah. His yeah. Arms maybe. Move. He can, maybe he can. Yeah. He, yeah. But how did he get to like? I, I swear he was like up high. <laughs> in some I think of... to be honest, I think he was in the same spot for most of the episode. He was just waiting for Jamie. 
Oh yeah, he goes, so, I'm waiting for an old friend. Yeah, and yeah. The, the amount of pettiness it takes to sit there and be like, mm -hmm. I'm gonna wait for the... You waited like two days in yeah. the snow, just... To see Jamie. Just, 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 just... So when Jamie rolls up, he could just look at him. And be like, I forgive you, <laughs> because I'm not Bran. <laughs> I'm not Bran, I'm the three-eyed raven. <laughs> yeah, but the dragon's a fucking dragon, so how would Bran beat a dragon? <laughs> I'll tell you how, because he's a warg, and all he has to do is warg into the dragon, turn the dragon's head, like that, that's it, Bran wins. You don't know he's gonna warg yeah. into a dragon. <laughs> he's only, he's only, he's, do it. he's only warged into Hodor, <laughs> and like, a raven. And dire wolves, and None probably other things. None of them are dragons. A dragon's fucking badass, man. Did you see those eyes when he was staring at Jon Snow make out with his aunt? That was, that was a fucking, yeah. that was a cool stare. It was. That, that was, was, a, was an intelligence there too. That was a staring at him like, mm -hmm. you know what you're doing. <laughs> deep down, deep down, you know. You know that's your aunt. Yeah. You know. He's like, I know, and I like it. And yeah. you know, and you like it. <laughs> Even when Jon Snow finds out later that mm -hmm. that's the case, he doesn't give a shit. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah like, you just, oh. <laughs> he just, oh, man, I really don't mm -hmm. want to be king, Sam. <laughs> <laughs> like, and he's like, no, but you're having sex with your aunt. He's like, huh? Huh? No, <laughs> no, but I don't want to be king. <laughs> yeah, so. you don't understand, Sam. <laughs> what are your predictions for how the next few episodes, if not the whole season, is going to go? Let me break it down. All right. All right. All right episode guys. one was the throwaway episode. <laughs> no, episode one was the setup. <laughs> mm -hmm. Episode two will be the setup. I think someone's going next episode. That's what I. I think that'll be the curveball because the battle is episode three. Mm -hmm. I think a minor character is going next episode like they somebody are, who they are big on killing minor characters yeah, they killed that one kid yeah. who nobody yeah. knew his name umber, i think umber, umber john <laughs> umber <laughs> steve i, I umber. say i say someone, umber kid. i say someone dies like maybe the old dude in winterfell that's mm -hmm. been there since season, uh, season one the dude with the beard the big big guy who's just been kind of there who's always in winterfell i don't remember his name he's like guy a council uh sansa the yeah that he, no that's uh royce from the veil oh Oh, he the, guy, the guy, the guy with the thing, yeah. he, he died. Long, oh, I know, he died, ago. yeah. But, um, but that dude And the old die. maester, he died in that same season. Yeah. But, yeah, so that was Royce. But I think a minor character dies next episode, mm -hmm. and they set up for the, the big fight. And right before the big fight, some shit goes down to where they're, like, they have, they're at a huge disadvantage because mm -hmm. of something. Like, they're already at a huge disadvantage. But then episode three, I say the entire episode is the battle. All mm -hmm. of it, the whole yeah. episode is just going to be the battle. It's gonna be a Lord of the Rings type esque shit going on, mm -hmm. and then I was totally gonna say that. <laughs> <laughs> and then, and then... I was, I was, that's what I was thinking too. Yeah, but yeah, it totally felt like, or it totally feels like, episode three is gonna be that <laughs> the shit, that Lord of the Rings massive epic battle, fucking yeah, yeah, the shit. It's gonna be. And then episode four is whoever's left, mm -hmm. either. Either the Starks and everybody at Winterfell have to retreat somewhere, mm -hmm. and then. Or some of them get away and go somewhere else. Maybe to, they mentioned it in this episode, maybe to wherever the Greyjoys are. The Iron Islands. Yeah. Maybe they retreat to the Iron Islands. And mm -hmm. then the rest of the army is marching down towards King's Landing. And then I think that just a bunch of random shit's going to go down in episode four. But mm -hmm. ultimately, that's where like what's going to happen. They mm -hmm. might just show like some aftermath stuff. Yeah. But I don't think anything that big is going to happen in episode four, unfortunately. But I think well, episode... yeah, I mean, after a huge battle yeah, in episode three, right. it has to cool down, has to yeah. wind down. But it's supposed to be longer, so who knows? But I yeah. think I think that episode will end at, like, knock, knock, King's Landing, we're fucking here, motherfuckers. Mm -hmm. And then episode five is whatever goes down at King's Landing. Whatever mm -hmm. it's going to be, I think Cersei battles the, <laughs> the whites, and she might win. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and then I think Cersei's going to be the ultimate bad. And I think she's going to fight Jon Snow, the, the rebels, <laughs> after. And then episode six will be classic Game of Thrones. Like, it's all over, but now we've got to settle the Game of Thrones thing. Who's going to get to the throne? Whoever's left, Danny or Jon is going to bite it. I'm calling it now. <laughs> They're not both surviving. I would want them to, so I hope I'm wrong. <laughs> but I don't think they're both making it up. Okay. My predictions all revolve around Cersei's obsession with elephants. I'll get back to that. <laughs> okay. 
she wants Ella Hunt to <laughs> battle the dragons. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> to show off. <laughs> Which it yeah. doesn't make any sense. <laughs> it doesn't make any sense. But. Mm, but I really, I know they have dragons, but if I just had one or two elephants, it'd be wrapped. rap. Yeah, well, because but. Lord of the Rings, they've got those <laughs> yeah. elephants. It's true. But, um, okay. Obviously, I feel like, I feel like it's pretty obvious the next episode is just them preparing for battle. They're, they're getting ready, they're prepared for the attack on Winterfell. It's going to end right as, you know, the, the attack's about to come. Yeah. yeah. Peter D. staring straight to the camera, just like in that little teaser. Mm-hmm. And, um, but that battle basically, yeah, I mean, Cersei, who knows, we'll fuck around and do some bullshit during the episode. Keep Have sex with, yeah. Right, yeah. <laughs> she went, you need to earn it, and then fucking <laughs> <laughs> immediately take him back to her room. But whatever, whatever. Um... And then the third you episode. You notice how they didn't show it? She's yeah. paid a little too high now. Yeah, definitely. And the uh, third episode's going to be the Battle of Winterfell. I think, again, that's obvious. People are going to die. Um, it's going to be epic, huge. That is the fucking moment. That is the thing we've been waiting for for years. And then after that, episode four, you're going to have that the sad moments of just remembering and kind of taking in like what happened after the battle. And then Cersei is going to meet whoever survives that, whether it's the Night King and the fucking the White Walkers or Jon Snow in the North or whoever survives. They're going to march south, meet Cersei and the Golden Company. And I think in episode four, they're not going to fight yet. It's too soon. Or maybe they start to at the very end. Like, it'll end maybe with them meeting. And then whoever wins, let's say Cersei wins. What if she's the... She's the ultimate bad, mm-hmm. and maybe it's bittersweet because the White Walkers are defeated, and she wins. And then in episode six, uh, or no, no, okay, I fucked that all up. Let me rephrase this. Okay, and then in episode five, you have whoever survives the North march down south, fight Cersei and her people, and then I want to say it's going to end with a cliffhanger. Episode six will will start with the end of that battle, and then you'll see who really won the Game of Thrones. Like and a then Stannis thing. Yeah, and then you'll just get to see like, okay, somebody dies, and somebody wins, and then the aftermath, and all the aftermath. I think it'll be a lot like Lord of the Rings, where it's like you think it's over, and then another scene happens, Constant and another, endings, and another, yeah. and another. Because it's so amazing and epic, and people love the world, so you have to. I think you have to do something like that. I just you hope can't, they... <laughs> you can't end episode six with the final battle. Oh, Jon Snow won it all, or Cersei won it all, or and then roll credits. Like, oh god, that would hurt. I say they do a Kingdom Hearts ending, mm-hmm. where they have epic music playing and they show what happened mm-hmm. to each and every like character <laughs> yeah and there's like there's a dramatic montage mm-hmm. music happening where you mm-hmm. see the resolution of yeah, everything or, or even just like little clips of like well 10 years later here they are now and like samuel Tarly, <laughs> they're dropping off he's their running children the, at yeah. hogwarts oh, <laughs> john snow's like all older <laughs> and seriously they're together they're like <laughs> they see each other they nod i remember yeah. do you remember yeah you I remember? remember i remember <laughs> and fun. okay other theory wild other theory White Walkers win. They march south. Cersei knows she has no chance of winning. Her and your, her boy, your I can't talk. You're on. Her boy, you're on Greyjoy, swoops her. They go to Essos where elephants. Boom. Elephants. She has her kid. They ride off into the sunset on elephants. End of Game of Thrones. That's their spinoff series yep, for we go. in ten years when they're totally gonna do one. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> there we go. It'll be that. Yeah. But so. Talk to us. Let us know what do you think is going to happen. Right, we're going to do this every week. Yeah. So just drop your theories below. We'll Peter talk Dinklage about it. is front and center mm-hmm. for that clip. He yeah. better not fucking die. Episode three. Oh my I god! I swear dies. to God, he is right there in the shit. He's not a fighter. <laughs> if, <laughs> he is not a fighter if that motherfucker, if they he kill, was in the Battle of Blackwater, he could, and he got knocked out. <laughs> he almost died. Yeah, he almost. Died. If his ass dies. In episode three. Then we might not keep making we, videos. Then, I don't know. And then our videos will stop episode three. <laughs> yeah, that was it. That's yeah. when Game of Thrones ended. And, uh, yeah. If him and Varys have a stupid moment where they're both dying and they're like, hey man, at least we went out together. I'll be like, no, no, you can't do this. What were you doing on the battlefield? Yeah, what were you doing on the battlefield? <sighs> All right. Well, until next week. Later.